Welcome to episode 7, you guys. In the last episode, you remember that Peter was looking for Cosmo and got trapped at the end by the Blood Brothers. And we also see what happened to Peter uh, when he was 13 years old and also what happened to his mom. So if you didn't catch that, make sure to go to the previous episode and check that out. So, let's get started. Go! <laughs> What the, what the hell, old buddy? What are you doing there? You scuts got lucky. Yeah. We almost heard her up. Word is murdered. That's what he said. Sheesh, no use being pediatric. <sighs> oh, crap. Would kill a lot of you. Not you, <laughs> Mr. Big Words. Nope. Lady H won't be you alive. Not too alive. Well, then you have failed your mission. Miserably. Peter Blue. <laughs> These lackluster bounty hunters claim Lady Hellbender hired them to kill us. Hey, we're no slouches. We're part of the league now. No, no, no. You said yourself she'd hunt us to the end of the universe. I had hoped she'd send a monster. Not these two. We would have murderized you. But don't worry. There's more coming. Did you hear that, Peter Quill? A silver lining. Yeah, that's great, Drax. Won't be long in these clabber traps. Not us. Mm-mm. Friends will be breaking us out soon. Huh? Real soon. When you wish we did kill. Be silent. Nice that you finally showed up. Would have been even nicer if you didn't abandon me in the first place. I never left. One minute, we're having a great time, and the next... Wait a second, did you use me as bait? Huh. Break lady eight eight well, your plan eight worked. Eight. A little I too well, seeing how we're so in jail now. We're all in prisons of our own making, Peter. Hey, this is a big mistake! I'm innocent! Cosmo, are you out there? Cosmo! How do we get out of here? Hello? Cosmo? I really need to use the bathroom. Yeah. Get your mitts off of him! Crude. Ow! The little bugger just scratched me! Oh, I'll do more than that. I'll murderize you. Uh. <laughs> hey, guys. Hey, I expect to see you here. Yeah, cram it, Flatnard. Flatnard? Yeah, and a scruff crew in one, too. Shut up and get in there! <laughs> He's still angry with us. Come on, dude. What's your problem? You are. That's why we quit. Yes, you did. Now stop talking to him. Rocket, buddy, come on. We had a good thing going. You and Groot are better than two-bit bounty hunters. Scoff. What did you say? I said scoff. You don't say scoff, you just scoff. Oh, so now I don't express myself proper like? <sighs> you know what? You're a real piece of buff. Rocky, dude, woof. We should have buffed you in when we buffed the chance. <laughs> like, buff we are. You don't, woof, woof, woof. What? You buff in front of me? I told you a bajillion times. I'm not a buffing animal. What are you talking about? You woof. <laughs> 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 Still on no <laughs> Osmo! How you doing, buddy? We were just about to... <laughs> Guardian of Galaxies will tell Cosmo why they broke into Continuum Cortex. Or Cosmo will conjure worse psychic gulag. Broke into the Do not feed Cosmo cat biscuits, Peter Quill. You work with Blood Brothers. Create distraction so pesky raccoon and sentient tree friend can use Continuum Cortex. Cosmo also know Guardian of Galaxies have Nova Tracker on ship. Okay, I'm sure it's just one big misunderstanding. Right? Right. We're here because something happened on the... No oh. 
Guardian of Galaxy were on Novorok. Yeah, we went to find Centurion Corral and pay our fine. Why? Strange transmissions spreading across galaxy. Like rabbits in springtime. Cosmos sent many team to investigate, none return. Now Novorok sending same signal. Guardian of Galaxy will tell me what they saw. The Nova Corps were killing each other. It was like they were drinking funky juice or something. Or joined the cult. Yeah, during that ritual with the priest. They kept talking about a promise. <laughs> right away, sir. Fraternity and Raptors. Cult of the Negative Sounds. Universal Church. Whoa, 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 stop! <laughs> That's them. That old man that's with them. His shuttle exploded on the Hallis Hope. Grand Unifier Raker. Leader of the Universal Church of Truths. That name ring bell for Cosmo. His old cult. Very powerful during Galactic War. Now, not so much. You said the rock was transmitting a signal. What if the religion were somehow... And yet, the Universal Church of Truths died with gold skin god. Let us investigate the Hallows Hope for you. What? You said none of your teams return, right? Seems to me like you're short-staffed, and we want to find out what happened as much as you do. We do. So let us investigate for you. Always a catch, Peter Quill. And not, not fun, fun kind with ball. <laughs> what Guardian of Galaxies want in return? Simple. Drop the charges. Contact Nova Corps HQ and get the world mind to forgive our fine. Then we'll go. It's not being so easy. Face it, dog breath. You need us. Us? For now. Unless you got someone else stupid enough to go. In Soviet Russia, Cosmo would not trust words of capitalist scum. But this is not motherland. And Cosmo no power of collateral. Guardian ship, stay on nowhere. What? You can't take our ship? My ship. How are we gonna find the Hallow's Hope? Ask Pesky Raccoon. Now come, essences of time. So where are we going exactly? To original settlement. From early days, before Kiva could come. You mean the first mining colony is still here? Duh. Now abandoned. Mostly entirely restored. This is the place you broke into. Broke implies it took effort. Wait, this is the Continuum Cortex? It's the best way to reach Nova ship before moves again. You found Corel. Where is she? Nova ship currently in a leader system, orbiting Michael planet. Contraxia. Cosmo not surprised. Pesky Raccoon enjoy garbage planet. Their restrooms do provide valuable information. Entire planet now broadcast same signal as Nova Rock. Cosmo not understand purpose or intention. All them bars and bedding parlors and brothels. Maybe it's not such a bad thing after all. Cosmo paint to agree with Assassin. You were having a great time when... Stop! We can find Corel and save Contraxia. Maybe we shouldn't make too many guarantees. We're the Guardians of the Galaxy. This is what we do. I am with you, Peter Quill. You are? Of course. It was a rousing speech. Bootlicker. How many people know about this place? Enough. It's not broadcast across galaxy. 
but scientists. So what is this? Like another elevator? They'll figure it out. Please just stand back. Guardian of Galaxies. Whoa! Magnificent witchcraft is this? I know. It's like they've never seen a giant transdimensional hand before. Please do step in ball. What if things go sideways? How do we get back? With passport. Can communicate with Cosmo and if emergency, bring Guardian of Galaxies back. Better you take it than Captain Valor over here. This time, investigate Novish. Use passport to report findings. And you'll speak to the world mind? Get rid of that fine, right? Those won't do the best. Good luck, Guardian of Galaxies. Anyone see any seatbelts? You better not throw up this time. This is... Sorcery? I was going to say dizzying. I don't. You get used to it. We in space? We're somewhere between space, between dimensions, between time, between realities even. What do you mean, between? We could theoretically go wherever and whenever with this thing. Even the places that don't exist, but uh, do. It's incredible. Avengers! Assemble! <laughs> what kind of name is Avengers? <laughs> Over us. Who are these gods you speak of? Goddesses. Uh, Drax? <laughs> I am not the one laughing. It's obviously an ill omen of our impending deaths. No matter where you hide, I will find you. Or it's an alternate oh. reality. Is it his kid? <laughs> I know the son. I am proud of Definitely an alternate reality. Hey, help! It's Spider Man! Wait, is that Earth? Mom? Come on, you're date for the promise here. <gasps> Come on in, Janie. Peter will be up in a second. Really? Janie? Okay, next stop, Alice Hope. Probably. <gasps> Flark! Portal's breath! Okay, here we go! You guys okay? Do we look okay? Well, hang in there. I'll try to restore gravity. Oh, great. We're gonna be stuck like this forever. Rocket, buddy, what am I looking for? Drax, tell Scut Lord most ships use external power conduits to generate pseudo gravity in hyperbaric airlocks. The beast says to find a power conduit. Right, and what do those look like? Okay, I've got two conduits here. Someone tell them to turn them on. Nothing's happening. Gamora, tell him to check the power supply. It's empty. Then tell him to find a battery. Did you catch that? Yeah, yeah. Something terrible happened here. What gave it away? The lack of gravity or the general destruction? Okay, got us a battery. Took him long enough. Hey, I'm trying, man. And we're still floating around. Okay, I got the battery installed, Gamora, but nothing's happening. Seriously? I'll tell them. Listen up, slug breath. Tell me what you see. Uh, there's a blue wire and two connections, yellow and red. And one big green thing. Don't touch the green thing! Not a great time to start <laughs> yelling, dude! Okay. Okay. First, plug the wire to either connection. All we need is a little jump start. To either one? It's not brain surgery. Uh, here goes nothing! Oh, crap! Everybody, just hold on! Oh, I'm, 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 I'
that was close. The gravity was not restored. You had one job, Quill. I did exactly what. Uh. Uh. If I had any units, I'd bet that mutt knew what we were getting into here. Impressive, Peter Quill. I didn't know you could do that. Neither did I. Those firearms are becoming quite formidable. Second time they've transformed like that. Should we call Cosmo? Let him know what we found so far? What do you mean a code word? Fine. Groot won't call the mud until we all agree on a code word. Could be useful if we get cornered by whatever's on the ship. How about Quill Kill? The code word is sweep the leg. <laughs> and we should hold off calling Cosmo until mm. we figure out what's going on. We should also standardize our use of the term dog report item to distinguish information of interest to our investigation. Then you'll sweep the leg. This is the only way out, but the door's got no juice. Must be on a different circuit. Can't you transfer power to it? I'm not the one with the zappy guns. Dog report item. Something caused Novacore to abandon their ship. Maybe they all just quit. Some people don't give up when things start going wrong. Was that a crack? No, it was a pointed criticism. I am Groot. Guys, Rocket left, but he's back now. That's all that matters. What is the dog's investigation? And whether or not Nikki and Corell are okay. Fine, multiple things matter. That'll do it. Why does that keep happening? There, you all felt that, right? Yep. The same thing happened when I tried to restore the gravity. Dast. Looks just like what happened on the rock. Indeed. It was a desperate attempt at a last defensive position. Good bottleneck for it. Everything that happened seems to be connected to this ship. Maybe your girlfriend went crazy after seeing you. I doubt Peter Quill could inspire this level of mutiny. Okay, we need to get to Corell's office. Someone tell Quill. Come on, dude. Can't we just talk to each other? Fine. You do know your girlfriend probably didn't make it. Now you are just being spiteful. Still nothing but emergency power. Dog report item. Power outage in several sections of the ship. What are we missing? Let's run through it all. We got arrested by your girlfriend. As did the churchman Grand Unifier Raker, and then his ship exploded. So maybe that's where it started. Raker might have had something on his ship. Wish I knew the layout of this tub better. Then we could figure out where this started. You know where we are, Gamora? Not really. Anova never really let me out of their sight. They had good reason not to trust you. This again? I was only stating that Nova's position of not trusting you is accurate. The longer we bicker, the more we might miss. Very inspirational. Yeah, you get that off a of placemat? All I'm saying is we're in this up to our necks, and we'll... No wonder we've been stumbling around in the dark. Whoa, ho, ho. look at you, you sexy beast. Ah, flirting rocket. Is it supposed to be upside down? Eh, <laughs> only if you wanted to channel all the ship's power up through the ceiling. Makes no sense to me. There must be a reason. A bad one. Try that console. Uh, we can use this to re-invert the core, or a uh, uh, de-invert. Uh, de de-vert? Rocket. Uh, the console safety lock because the mounting arms are retracted. If we can pop them out of them side panels, we can flip the core. There's got to be more machinery up there. Gamora, give me a boost. Of course. A little more help, Gamora. Right here. This time. Here it comes. Well, Peter Quill's mask to guide us with his mysterious power. Ain't nothing mysterious about it. I programmed the Dastin thing. Definitely something up here. Obviously. Hell yeah, it worked! You know, them guns would make better engineering tools than weapons. Nice try. Let's get the other one free. Alright, Gamora, let's get the second one done. Okay. 
gonna work without the arms. Now let's... Guys! We've got incoming! Yeah! It's more of that infected freaks! Oh, man! I was hoping we'd find Nova Corps here, but not like this! Now we know who inverted the core! But why? Let's just get it done! Did you notice the rumbling stuff when we flipped the reactor away from the ceiling? We must find a way up there and discover why, for the dog report. Rocket, what's that console telling you? That you should come do the honors. Okay. Whoa, surprise! This whole thing's a lift! We can Whoa. ride it all the way up there. I guess Nova Grunts and Grease Monkeys don't get the cool flying suits. Typical. Nobody respects their engineers these days. If you want efficiency, you gotta make whoa, Clark! Foggy clamps! They're shutting us down! More freaks approach! Clark has de re inverted the core again! We'll just have to re de re invert it back! After we take some heads! Good work, you two! I don't think we need to worry about those lines! Alright! Let's get those clamps off so we can keep moving. I will tear them from their sockets. Ain't gonna work, Musclehead. But this time, we've got a control room to play with. Okay. Looks like I can remove the clamps from here. Good. We will not be stopped by clamps. Duh! <laughs> Sneaky dash bags. They scrambled the power circuit so I can't release them. Tired of these clamps. Gonna have to reroute the circuits one by one to reset the power grid. Here, I'll get the door for you. You should be able to see the grid with your visor. Okay, visor's up. Now what? You should see power grids along the walls around here. Find their powered up nodes. Looking for glowy power nodes. Right. When you find them, you need to electrify the junction switch in the direction you want the power to flow. Shoot them with electricity? Yeah, we're aiming for big, glowing lines routing back towards the clamps in the middle. Maybe I can get up higher to see what's going on. Any ideas? Working on it. That's got to be one of the power nodes, just need to reroute it. So, is there any chance that we will get it back together with Lady Law? Did that do anything? Not yet. You'll have to reroute a couple of them. What does Hallow's Hope do, anyways? Other than being a giant pain in the tail. It's a peacekeeping ship. Groot, I think I have an idea. Use your roots to raise that platform with me on it. Kind of a Groot root boost thing. He's eager to try the Groot root boost. <laughs> Neat trick. Groot loves being helpful. That's another power node. Perhaps the Nova Killer knows how to redirect these machines. She has experience. I was an assassin, not a saboteur. Same results either way, right? Would you rather paint with a paintbrush or a mop? Drax, I need a hole here to reach the grid. And you will have one. Uh-huh. Another power node. Go 
Uh, when is that? Brutes right. Groot, need your help, buddy. Root boost, please. I bet I can reroute the power to get myself back out of here. Solid plan. Everybody stay alert. Quill has a knack for pushing the wrong buttons or crossing the wrong wires. The small hairy one is insinuating you bad luck. Hell yeah! Who's smarter than Nova Corps? What did that open? <laughs> Kinda wondering why Cosmo didn't fetch a bunch of his muscle and do this himself. Simple. Required professionals. Yeah, the poopsher don't even need to lift a paw to take down Lady Albender's invincible goons needs us. Real likely. That should be the last one. Let's get you rerouted. open and I got the power flowing through almost qualified to be a junior engineer thanks wait this is not the right one without your button pusher. Now that we know the infected Nova are here, we can agree that whatever's going on upstairs is really bad, right? They were furious when we removed their power source. Must be important to their effort. Can't wait to smash it. Whatever it is. And then get back to Cosmo for our reward. All right, this is our floor. These doors are sealed tight. Just look for another way out. Gamora, can you pry that thing open for us? And bend my sword? Nope. Drax, hit that panel where all the wires connect. <laughs> Step aside. Good job, buddy. Come out to the coast. We'll get together, have a few laughs. What's that? Uh, nothing. No, that. They must have flipped the core back. Something's powering up again. Great. Now we're stuck in the ventilation. Great job, Quill. Dude, I know you're peeved, and I'm sorry. Apology accepted. Really? That's it? In case you hadn't noticed, there's more important things happening right now than Quill saying he's sorry. Whoa! Flark and Scut! What are these rattling gaboons doing to Contraxio? What is this thing, Rocket? I don't know. Like it's siphoning something! Something to do with those kills? Dunno! I gotta get a closer look! Peter Quill, we have been in this hangar before! Never have allowed this to happen to a ship! 
So, you think she escaped? I don't know. She could be holed up in her office. <laughs> We're not leaving till we find out what happened. What the? Dog report item. Scott, that's loud. This is where the churchman's shuttle exploded. Yeah, but well, it looks a little different now. Because of the giant machine, yes, but I assure you, Peter Quill, this is where you and the girl almost fell to your death. Dog report item. Massive device siphoning energy from Contraxia. Don't forget the energy cube. Dog report item. Energy stored in strange cubes. Should I go down there? Far madness! Hold on to what? Compiling an extensive dog report. Ah, flark the report. Tell him his magic hand almost got us killed. Contraxia isn't looking so good. They're killing it, is what they're doing. Tell Cosmo what is happening. They've got this giant ray thing he pointed at the planet. It's collecting some kind of energy. Have Guardian found Centurion Corel? Not yet. Uh oh. What is. Uh oh, Piotr Quinn. Something just came up. We'll call you back. Your experience fighting Centurions will be necessary here, woman. Spread out! How long? You wanna tell us what's going on with Contraxia? Don't think they're gonna give us a tour, Peter! I wondered how we would fare against the Centurion. What's Centurions that? have a lot of tricks up you their sleeves! You don't get a chance! Okay, seems to me like this ship might be ground zero for whatever's happening. We gotta find Corral, get some real answers. Do you have any idea where she is? I'm thinking we check her office. I even know how we can get there. You know a way out of the hangar? Yeah, Drax spotted it on our way in. We can use the hole Nikki and I fell into when Rager's shuttle exploded. You know, we never did talk about why you jumped- Drax, gonna need you to drag this over. I will assume you have a plan. That seemed like a wasted effort. All plans need steps to succeed. Uh, what new age drivel have you been reading? We need to stop the batteries from moving, Peter. Really thought that might work. What am I missing? I shall add this to my report. Ain't it already in your report? I shall add it again. Rocket, can you see where that vent leads? Anything to get out of here. We should be prepared in case the beast tries to destroy this machinery. Just like I said. 
thought. Impressive work, Peter Quill. Just hope it does not cause an explosion. Well, let's not oh. stick around to find out. Come on, come on, come on. All right, come on, the tunnel's just past here. We got lucky no one else showed up. The Unifier has detected an intrusion. Spread oh. out. It right. will be contained by, by her will. will. Move! There's too many of them. In the hole! Jump! Still don't get why you jumped after the kid back then. Top ten dumbest things I ever saw you do. You should have seen how worried he was. Hey, Star Pants was our ticket with the captain. I was worried his death would lead to more jail time. It was adorable. I hate you all. Pretty sure this is right. Pretty sure? Everything was on fire last time. I couldn't make that happen. No, no. Rocky, no. <laughs> He's so funny. Ain't that a piece of the Unifier's old ship? Unifier. Yeah, whatever. When we were arrested, they mentioned Raker got caught for the same thing we did. Not exactly the same. He got caught scavenging in the quarantine zone. How is that not the same? Forget Raker. Our focus right now is finding Nikki. Your focus? My focus is not dying on this stupid ship. The dog wants us to find Centurion Corel. Right. So we're multitasking. I did not realize you and the girl fell down so far, Peter Quill. I didn't fall. I jumped. Heroically. So, how did you and Nikki get through here last time? I don't remember anything being in the way before. Just a lot of fire. So visor her up already. Figure something out. One more time, Groot. Let's go find Corel and Nikki. Dog report item. The rumbling continues. So, we all agree that the captain and her kid are probably dead, right? Corel survived the worst of the war. And a relationship with Peter. Still willing to bet they didn't survive this. You whoa, wager whoa, whoa. on whether or not a mother and child are dead. Be careful down there, Peter Quill. Yeah, definitely a lot sparkier than last time. That'll work. What do you say, Gamora? Now that the floor can't kill us? I say, no problem. Well, definitely no sign of Nikki or Corel. I mean, I guess that's good news. Thinking about exit plans. The exit plan is to call Cosmo after we get the answers we need. Answers you need, maybe. Don't suppose you've seen Nikki? I'm sorry. What? You feeling okay, Peter? Does not strike me as very safe here, Peter Quill. Better this than getting shot at. Eh, speak for yourself. You'd rather get shot at? More fulfilling to shoot someone I don't like than look for someone I don't care about. Our leader seems to care, and so we should also pretend to care. I am Groot. <sighs> of course you would. Careful, Peter Quill. Okay, don't remember this green gas being here last time. I think you mean deadly green gas. This whole strip's a death trap now. I'm sure there's a way to unburst these pipes. There! Crazy feet! Ah, uh, more death gas! Maybe Nikki and Corral are using it to protect themselves. Take it down, Gamora. Yep, I'm on it. <laughs> you sure this is the right way? Just keep your eyes open. You know, Peter, 
If Nikki and Corel really are... They're not. I'm just saying we should be ready for anything. They're not. Find a dog report item. Come on, crude. Here, this is definitely the right way. Nikki's secret hideout is just through here. Thought we were going to the captain's office. We are, right after we check here. Try not to break anything. This place means a lot to us. Oh, wow. Didn't Nikki paint all this? Pretty cool, right? Nikki? Little one, reveal yourself. I knew this would come in handy. Where'd you get a Nova Paskey? <sighs> Careful, Peter Quill. In my experience, children often booby trap their toys. It's not Nikki's, it's mine. So we're just claiming our stuff now? Because if we are... No, I mean it literally used to belong to me. Uh, Quill, you gotta see this. This kid's obsessed with you. Wait, why does she have your toy? It's just something I gave to Corel when we were together during the war, like a keepsake. It doesn't mean anything. Does, uh, this mean anything? How old is the child? Oh, um, it's her Quill. daddy. Ha! <laughs> Congratulations, Peter Quill. You will make a terrible father. Unless the child is dead, in which case, it does not matter. W wait is this why you dragged us here? Clearly. The child is 12, and Quill was with the child's mother. Yes, okay. So the dates maybe kind of match up, so it's possible, I guess. As long as they had a health class on this. Inspiring. Can we just focus on if Corell and Nikki are okay? They're clearly not here, so let's... Move on and keep looking. Anyone else feel weird going through Nikki's stuff like this? Peter Quill is her father. It is his duty to pry into her personal life. For all we know, maybe this guy's her dad. Yeek. Looks like an even bigger deadbeat than you. Still can't get over how good she is with all this tech stuff. Staring at it ain't gonna change what it says. I'm thinking Nikki won't mind if we use this. What do you say, Rocket? I say I don't care even if she does mind. All right, let's do this one. One shiny upgrade, nice and crafty. Thank you, Rocket. Okay, where were we? Congratulating you on being a father. Thanks, Drex. Should be a way to Corel's office through those pipes on the left. Yeah, I see an opening. Could be there's a latch on the inside. Allow me, Star Dad. Ha 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 ha! I get it! <laughs> Guys! Can we not make light of all this? We still don't know if they're okay. I am capable of feeling concerned while still laughing at you, Peter Quill. Ditto! Got to admit it, Quill. Kid's whole setup is pretty impressive. The way she rigged her terminal to the emergency power grid. I told you, she's a smart kid. Perhaps Peter Quill did not sire this child after all. Yeah, I could see that. She just don't seem dopey enough. Maybe she gets everything from the mother's side. Okay, Drax is clearly onto something, so let's all just go with that. That Nikki is too smart to be your daughter. Whatever it takes to get out of this. You're really gonna be one of those dads? No, that's not what I... I don't know. Point is, none of us know. That's the elevator I took with Corel and Nikki. If we're lucky, maybe they're on their way down right now. Oh, so much for your girlfriend, Mina! Oh, it did oh. seem likely. 
All I know is I am really starting to hate this elevator. They know we were coming! Of course they knew! We you ain't okay? exactly Anyone been hurt? What? Are you gonna start being all paternal now? We're fine, Peter. We know how to fight. I know. I, I just... We'll find them. Don't worry. You said Corral's office was up top somewhere? More deadly gas. Oh, yeah. He's definitely stalling. What do you expect? He's got the emotional maturity of a two-year-old. Are you speaking of Peter Quill? Obviously. I'll have you know, I am super emotionally mature. of deadly gas over confronting your fear of fatherhood. I did not! Stop analyzing! Dog report item. There's no dog report item. I have been thinking. It is customary on Katath to bathe new fathers in a river of blood. Next stop, Corel's office. something. And Nikki's a tech expert, knows her way around ships. Come on, just admit it, Quill. You're freaking out right now. This whole deadbeat dad thing's gotta be eating at you. Some need many years to fully comprehend their paternal responsibility. Some never do. Well, that don't look good. There was a struggle here. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm reacting to? I am reacting in my own way. This doesn't look good, Peter. All we know is that there was a fight. Hello? Corral? Nikki? Looks empty. Feels empty. Maybe they're hiding. There are always strange writings on the wall. I'm gonna try and get in her computer, see if I can wipe my criminal history. Rocket! I'm kidding. I'm gonna access her logs. You wanna know what happened here or not? Fine. The rest of us will take a look around. Maybe they left a clue or something. The scribbles are Cree. This one says, Mother knows best. Return, hope, promise. What is this? Some kind of a threat? The Cree Council demands proof of Nikki's heritage under the Cree Purity Laws. What Cree Purity Laws? Corel never told you that either? The Cree are extremely strict about their bloodlines. Ugh, this does not look good. For you? No, for Nikki. What are the chances the Cree are involved in any of this? The Council of Purity isn't cryptic. When they punish someone, they make sure everyone knows it. Corel and Nikki hanging from a wall. Nikki's ID. Something seems off, though. What do you mean, off? I don't know. Like it's been flagged or something. Not sure. Is the girl's date of birth on those documents? Okay, I'm in. But I got bad news, lover boy. What did you find? Come here and I'll show you. So what am I looking at? Nothing. She's the captain. Captains keep logs. You keep logs? I I'm trying to tell you, they're gone. All of them. Almost like the world mind went out of its way to sever everything. Have you tried turning it off and on? What about backups? Doesn't every Nova ship have a central hub or something? A Nexus mainframe, yeah. If there's ghosts anywhere in the system, that's where. I categorically refuse. Not literal ghost, Drax. He's talking about data. Right? Yes, but we'd have to access the Nexus directly. Means going to the bridge. We're not leaving until we find out what happened. Center of operations it is. According to the ship's map, the bridge should be right through here. Don't worry, Corral. I'll make sure this gets back to you. Peter, shouldn't we head for the bridge, try to access those logs? Yeah, yeah, I just want to be sure we didn't miss anything. 
Dog report item. It's one of them priests down there, ain't it? Okay, so let's. Oh, oh, oh crap! Uh, nuts to this. I'm out of here. Stop moving. Oh, right. Tell the dog about the priest. Robot priest. I am Groot. Groot says the mutt's not answering. Keep trying. The rest of us can focus on figuring a way out. Really? This is the server room, right? And servers mean data? That'll do it. Well played, Peter Quill. I am Groot. How am I supposed to know why the pooch ain't picking up? Keep trying. So according to the map I saw, Nexus should be just above us. Uh, shall I throw the rodent? No! Come on! on. <sighs> Alright, let's look around. Maybe we can find something. you could have used there, Drax? Perhaps we should have interrogated the robot priest. Yeah, next time we encounter a giant, deadly robot priest, we'll tie him up first and ask questions. Do you have rope? No. Then your plan is untenable. There's an open panel up in the corner there. Pretty sure that's our exit. Perfect. So we just gotta jump across a few of these floaty server things? Seems, uh, perfectly safe. They contain near infinite stores of data. Pretty sure they can temporarily support our puny mortal frames. Well, mine anyway. Are you cool? And yours too, yes. I think all of this could have been avoided had the rodent not broken the glass. You're blaming him for that? His panic scampering is what caused the final break. Your oversized gut is what caused the first 50 breaks! Hey Groot, any luck getting through to Cosmo yet? I am Groot. Nope, still nothing. Reception will probably be better once we're on the bridge. Yeah, I don't think that's how it works. Okay, this is it, the command center. Which I guess makes that the next control terminal. Fingers crossed we find something useful. I'm thinking you should do the honors, Quilt. Locked. I wonder, though. Nikki really didn't want her mom to know about this pass key she gave me. No way is some kid's card gonna bypass the next. Then we're in! You're kidding! What? Yes! Guys, we're in! Go to the criminal records, Quilt. They can't be that scary if they share a record. Wow. Another guy from Earth. Fun fact, that bounty on you put out is how me and Groot met Quill. Read it and weep, losers. There gotta be something in here. Hey, wasn't that the mining ship we explored in the quarantine zone, yeah. What is the footage from? Signal stronger. We must be close. How close? Hard to say. There's too much interference. Centurion Corral. Found something. She 
went in after we left. Flark. That thing. You don't think. It is the creature that devoured our monster. <laughs> Could have been a million things. I mean, it's restricted space for a reason. I am Groot. No, you're a Lotus Scut. That thing's got nothing to do with us. That gem Corral picked up. I think it's the same one we shot in the quarantine zone. Uh, we? You're the one who shot it. Fine, the gem I shot. The point is, is that shadow thing came out of it. We did this. The quarantine zone's a giant death trap. So we released a shadow thing. We made it out, didn't we? Your stupid girlfriend probably did too. You've been saying the whole time she's probably dead. Eh, probably alive, probably dead, whatever. Important thing is, we're all fine. Corel is tough. If anyone made it out, it's her. I know it. Read our intentions. No, you've made them pretty clear. Sometimes sacrifices. I had to check. Crew, <laughs> sweep the leg. Grand Unifier, Breaker, right? First, let me just say it's really cool that you've heard of us, right, guys? And it's cool that you didn't try to kill us just then, especially with your two pals right there. You could have totally ripped us apart the moment you walked in, which we obviously all appreciate. But also, we've kind of got a few questions, like... Where are Centurion Corel and her daughter? You came here seeking truth. Rejoice. The Matriarch wishes to share it with you. guys so much for watching make sure to hit that subscribe button and i'll see you guys in the next episode